Art is subjective. They say beauty is in the eye of the beholder. They also say, while looking forward towards the future, it's important to reflect on the past. And the City of Phoenix does exactly that when it comes to art. Starting in 1914, uh, the Phoenix Women's Club worked with school children and they worked together to accumulate enough funds to purchase the winner at the Arizona State Fair. And they did that by collecting pennies and all the school children donated pennies in order to purchase the first artwork for the city of Phoenix. And then from there, each year, the, the winner at the Arizona State Fair would then be selected and then uh, the city would purchase their work and then display it in City Hall. And that moved on to what we have as our municipal historic collection today. Some of these historic paintings are well over 100 years old and need to be preserved. Art conservation is a delicate process. We hire a professional conservator to come in and uh, together we choose what pieces need to be or need the most repair or are damaged. And then um, he then goes and then repairs these pieces. Gary Holbert is a very talented art conservator who is helping to preserve the history of Phoenix. Right now what I'm doing is taking off surface dirt and grime that is, has been underneath the bar, is underneath the varnish. And you can see from here to here, the surface dirt is removed in the sky, but from here to here, the dirt is still there. The city is incredibly fortunate to work with Gary Holpert, who is uh, a local painting conservator who specializes in this and does it day to day. And he's known nationally and internationally throughout art circles. And we, we're so lucky to have him here in Phoenix part of the time to help us with this work. You can find these beautiful works of art all around the city. The city owns about 1,200 pieces in our municipal art collection, and those are on display across 24 municipal buildings throughout the city. When the art is not displayed, it's stored in a special vault. Where we are now is one of our many storage rooms where we keep the artwork in safe conditions, uh, especially when they need to rest from the outdoor sun. And uh, this particular room, uh, has one of some more of our valuable pieces, such as our historic collections and our more delicate, fragile paintings that you can see behind me here. The city of Phoenix realizes the importance of keeping their history intact. In addition to the funds that the city council has approved for us to move forward with this restoration project, uh, we were really fortunate to get a grant from the NEH, the National Endowment for Humanities, in order to do a preservation assessment. In addition to that, a new private group, Friends of Phoenix Public Art, has formed to raise funds to help care for the city's art collection and to present exhibitions at the City Hall Gallery. These public and private efforts are going a long way toward preserving the art that we began collecting for our city more than a century ago. If you're interested in learning more about the city's public art collections, you can go to phoenix.gov forward slash arts. For Phoenix TV, I'm Deborah Cedillo-Dugan.